Hi YouTubers. So this is the Premed PA1000X Studio Pro Power Amplifier. 1000 watts bridgeable. Well, at least so they say. Well, the thing is, why I'm making a video about this is because this is not a normal amp. So it's it's been a bit modified by me. So I'm going to show you the modifications I did. Uh, come along for the show. So basically, I did three mods to the sound. One added secondary filter capacitors. Two second fan and three extra heat sinks for cooling. Uh, the bridge rectifier is under this section of heat sink. Originally was mounted to this heat sink. So I moved it, placed it once and has one separate heat sink. So that doesn't produce heat on the main driver transistor's heatsink. These two heatsinks added in for this fan for increased coolant. So, so the benefits of modern this amp in this way are from the filter capacitors, increased transient response, which means better base better power stability of the arm. The fan provides extra cooling to the entire PCB. And third, the extra heat sinks provide extra cooling for the transistors, meaning I can drive it harder for longer um, without the fan, the arm itself, thermal throttling. These mods have given this arm better transient response, which means better bass, cleaner sound, increased power, and I can raise the volume, which means I can raise the gain on the arm a lot higher before it starts clipping. This is the clip light. Now, since I did these mods, arm can go further without going into clip, clipping which means I have getting increased power from this arm and that's it thanks for watching and like and subscribe for more